Now, if we talk about question number 49, it is asked that what is the total stress for water pressure and effective stress at point P, which is located 5 meter below the ground level. And in this case, water table is also at ground level. Now, total stress is given by saturated unit weight in our case because soil is fully submerged. That means it is saturated when we are talking about total stress case. So, total stress is gamma sat into 5 or 21 into 5. It comes out as 105 kilonewton per meter square. If we talk about pore water pressure, it is given by gamma W into height of water column, which is 5 meter in our case since water table is located at ground level or 5 meter above point P. As a result of which, pore water pressure comes out as 50 kN per meter square. We know that effective stress or sigma effective is sigma total minus pore water pressure. Sigma in this case or sigma total is 105. Pore water pressure is 50 as a result of which effective stress comes out as 55 kN per meter square making C as the correct choice for question number 49. Thank you.